How's it going YouTubers? Nightmare70 here and I'm back with another toy review. Since if you reviewed my if you saw my Revenge of the Fallen Skywarp video, I mentioned that I would be back to making more videos and like mentioned I'm back. And today I'm reviewing Transformers Cybertron Deluxe Class Override. Now Override Override is a female for the Cybertron show and she does transform into a looks more like a Cybertronian race car to me since she is a Cybertron character and she is an Autobot where she her vehicle mode you can tell is red with with clear windows clear what clear red windows you can see some molded in seats even a steering wheel but not on this side but I don't even see steering wheel there not you can't really see like a lining but there is like a circle there representing the steering wheel which is pretty nice and I guess these could represent headlights I guess or these these little circles in the middle so I don't know much but I know that she was in the show and she's a pretty cool figure you can see her head sticking out her crown but you can't see the eyes so what that's all I care about as long as you don't see the face you're fine it is a nice looking race car with some white red and a little bit of blue and some I don't know like a gold it like it does look like kind of goldish bronze like I guess I don't know how you pronounce it but it is a shiny engine with these uh I don't know what they're called but it's got some black and red more has black and I don't know though but I don't have that figure out. I'm not going to buy that. Don't expect me to buy Override GTS because I'm. That looks ridiculous. It looks Undermine and Brush Guard. I actually got her as a bonus figure. And there is a shout out for that guy. Yeah, for that. If you remember my Undermine and Brush Guard review. So, yeah, that's right. This is a shout out to. Another shout out to Pine and uh, Brush Guard. If you've seen my review on them, you will see I compared Override with them. And he got me those three. I was purchasing. I was buying Undermine and Brush Guard from him, and he gave me Override as a bonus figure. So thanks, dude. Again, he might have what you're looking for. Now back with Override. Now, unfortunately, I don't have the box. It might, I think when my mom was trying to get rid of some garbage when she was cleaning the house, she might have recycled the box. And I, the instructions were there. But I wouldn't know how to transform her. But, so unfortunately I don't have the box to show it, show you guys, nor the instructions. But I did keep this, 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 the, her cyber key, which is the speed planet key. And it is gold because she is the speed planet leader. So it's, re it's red as normal, but instead of silver, the, the outside the outside lining is gold it's, or brawn. And it still has the code. DY7P and again if it unlocks a hidden story please let me know because again I don't know much about these I didn't collect Cybertron figures back in 2005 movie 1 Ratchet was my first figure so again let me know what they tell if you guys know what Override story is if you guys can remember of course please let me know what it's about what they're about and I guess these, and she got some spikes to I guess when she reverses, you could poke some Decepticons, I guess. But she is a nice race car. I mean, I, does roll pretty well. Even on these type of floors. Even on the carpet, she'll roll well. Which I'm not going to do right now, but I can tell you, she does roll pretty well. And again, since she is a Cybertron character, you insert the key, and this, you insert the key, and you'll see a little opening in here. You insert it, you insert the key, and you plug it in. Some little cannons or little mini guns, red guns pop, barreled guns can pop out. Again, when she drives around, she, when she's driving around, she can shoot some Decepticons. Pew, pew, pew. Yep. All right, Cyber Key Power. So show she can shoot some of the Decepticons. Do you want to see it again? Like, let me show you a closer look on what I'm talking about. You probably know what I mean. You see that little piece? You see that little keyhole? And then in front, you see that arrow representing, telling you that there is a, key, a keyhole for your cyber key. 
nice art. She has a nice little Autobot symbol. She has a little bit of blue. I don't know if I mentioned that. It's more like a tealish blue. It's hard to explain, but it still it still looks really nice on her. And again, I don't know. I don't think this is based on a real race car. It might, like I mentioned, it looks more of a Cybertronian race car. Oh yeah, she's got some. I guess bronze or copper, whatever color. She has some more paint. She has some painted wheels. The in the the outside is a clear red. And they do roll pretty well, like I mentioned. Again, again, you insert the key one more time. The, the, the gun's supposed to come out at once, twice, together. So insert the key, and voila, it stays. Now, if you want storage, you don't want to lose the cyber key, keep this plugged in. And then you can just, then you can just ready to shoot some Decepticons. Now again, I don't know what kind of car this is. I don't, I don't think it's based on a real car. Either way, let's do a little bit of a comparison. Here is she is next to Age of Extinction Lockdown. Now, just to tell you how big, how small Hasbro Hasbro has been shrinking the figures since the Michael Bay figures, Michael Bay movies came out. I think in Dark of the Moon they started to shrink. See, man, these now these are smaller than usual. usual. They are smaller than what you're used to having. See, see how big is? See how big all right is? Man, I miss the old figures. We miss. I'm sure everybody misses the big deluxe figures. Remember how big they were? I'm sure everybody misses how big they were. Does bring back some memories. Again, these could represent headlights, I guess. So she could have four headlights, I guess. Like two yellow, two I guess amber headlights, and two little blue headlights. And I guess. I guess the outsiding of the spikes, see the spikes, ignoring those, the outsiding could represent tail lights, I guess. So either way. It's so nice figure, nice looking race car, like I mentioned. Again, she was a speed planet, I think when Ma the leader of the speed planet key. And I think Megatron tried to ask her where the keys are. And I think he wanted, I think she wanted Megatron to race her, and she won. And I'm not sure what happened at the end. I didn't watch, only, I didn't watch the whole show on the internet. I still watch it, because I am a big Cybertron fan, but I didn't watch all of it. I'm trying to get to that part. So either way, to transform override, what you, have to, what you want to do, take the key out if you don't have it out. Best to put the barrels back in place for the cyber key power. You, you hear them click, proving they're locked on well. Remove this piece. It, it is going to be her gun. And see this black piece? You click on it. See? That's what it does. It's like an automorph figure. It's like an automorph. So I'm, I'm try it again. Click the black piece. That's weird. Her head will come out. One of her arms, her arms will stick out. They're both stick out together. One got stuck. See, you have her front body, and you see, you'll get the Autobot symbol already. And for this piece, rotator 180 degrees, detach the feet, bring this up, bring the bring that forward, bring that down a little bit. You'll see a little plug. You see a little connection piece there. There will be a little. See that? See that peg right there? Plug it in. That will, that way it's not just sitting there. You have the front of her, right? And look, she has a gap. <laughs> We're gonna solve that. Oh dang, did it just get loose? Oh yeah, it got loose, hang on. Now, sorry. Bring the, bring the legs forward a little bit, or wait, from there bring them, uh, if I can get, if you can get them unstuck. Hang on, give me just a minute, hang on. Oh yeah, I see what I was doing. You're supposed to, from like this, bring them, like this, is a little forced. And then you'll see a little tab there. Click it in. Ro bring the f legs forward. Bring this forward. There will be a, there will be a kneecap, there will be a heel spur for her. And do the same thing for the other leg. Oh yeah. Or I guess you just have to take this out front first. And then put it back together. Sorry if you can't see well. I'm not looking at my phone. I'm looking at the figure. 
Time to get the plug back in. There we go. There you go. Do the same thing for this leg. Bring the heels bird up. And then she has her, her she has little sh her arms are really short, which does I do feel, which does look kind of weird. Uh, one thing I hate about this figure, I'm not gonna sell it, of course. It's still a nice figure. Is her arms are really short. See how short they are? They're very short. But anyway, her head it can't go up and down, but it can barely move. I, it can barely move, so barely any articulation. She her arms can go 360 degrees like this. Bend, bend at the elbow. Bend, bend at the elbow. They can go this far. She can do this. It's like she's gonna lift some weights, I guess. That's what I like to consider it. She can do a soccer kick. Goal! Hey, right. yes, I grew up watch. I grew up. I grew up playing soccer. I'm Mexican, you guys. But anyway, playing soccer can be pretty fun. I might do it for school. I don't know yet. I'd rather not. I've been having too much trouble with kids. A lot of there's this. I'm t there's this jerk giving me too much trouble. I'd rather not do sports with him anymore. Oh, I heard he got kicked out for good. Cause he did something really bad. I think he s stole someone's jewelry. Or oh, I think made them lost them. So I think he's got he's banned from sports forever. Well, I do unified sports. It's like life skills sports. I think he got banned from them f for good. Anyway, I probably might still not do it. Who knows? You wait. There's 360 of we'll ride. Man, I go back to school in 10 days. Can you believe it? Today's July 8th. I go back to July 18th. I'm not ready to go back to school. But anyway, I'm about to be a senior. And I'm doing it a week earlier than normal. If you, We're going back a week earlier than normal so we can be done before Memorial Day. But anyway, like I mentioned, I'm about to be a senior. And to be honest, I really need driver's ed. So I don't care if I go back that early. I'm, I'm saving up my money. It's a $100 fee. I'm at 60 bucks right now. So I might not collect any figures at the, mo at the moment, but I will do reviews of what I have, and I have tons to review. Again, Override, she still has the same colors from her vehicle mode, except this time her face has a little bit of orange, and she still has the Autobot symbol on the right side, on her left. And she, she looks pretty cool. Even for an Autobot, she looks pretty cool. And if you look closely here, on her head, it looks like she has light piping. I did do that a few a while ago, and unfortunately, it won't show. It's, it looks like the eyes are just painted.